Fuel Watch, Perth's petrol prices, brought to you by the Department of Consumer Protection and Seven News. Hello, this is Widget. He's a 14-week-old staffy bull terrier cross looking for a home. He's great with kids and would love to live with active people, but Widget's deaf, so he'll need a very special family who's willing to teach him sign language commands. And he's currently at the Malaga office of the RSPCA. Our minimum 14.3 at 1.34 this morning, the top 22.6 at 11 o'clock, currently 18.8 degrees, the relative humidity 91%, the barometer 1009 and rising, wind from the west at 11 kilometres an hour. Temperatures around the metro area around 23, noticeably cooler in the hills. We've had 6.6 millimetres of rain since 9 this morning, which is great news. Around the state today, our hotspot Roeburn with 40 degrees, the lowest overnight minimum 12 degrees at Bridgetown. Seven satellite weather watch for the past 24 hours. Isolated showers and thunderstorms in the north and west Kimberley. In the southern half, scattered showers and isolated thunderstorms throughout the southwest land division and some thunderstorms in the Eucla as well. Some decent falls in parts of the southwest. Witchcliffe had 59 millimetres of rain to nine this morning and a very wet day in Bridgetown. They've had 48 millimetres since nine o'clock. Looking at the synoptic chart, the cold front is slowly moving through the lower southwest bringing those scattered showers. As it heads inland, the band will weaken. The showers should contract to the coast tonight and clear later tomorrow. A high pressure system moving south of the state on Wednesday should bring fine weather and east southeasterly winds. Eastern states tomorrow, an early shower or two for Sydney, early fog in Canberra and Melbourne, fine in all other centres. Boat and surf, west-northwest winds, 18 to 23 knots, shifting south-southwest 15 to 20 knots by morning and tending southerly 15 to 20 knots in the afternoon. Seas to 1.5 metres, the swell to 1.5 as well. The forecast, a shower or two overnight and in the early morning, then fine, a minimum of 14 and up to 21 tomorrow. Wednesday fine, a top of 23, Thursday mainly fine and 25, Friday, fine and 26. Looking ahead to the weekend, a shower or two developing, tops in the low to mid-20s. Good night. Here's Rick. Thanks, Moran. And finally, you might have seen the big banana and the big pineapple, but what about the big pumpkin? This whopper from Port Lincoln in South Australia weighs in at 300 kilograms, an Australian record. Grown by Ken and Rosemary Holden, the pumpkin was planted last November and at one stage was adding 7.5 kilos a day. Now it's off to the local hospital to be turned into soup and lots of it. And that's seven news for this Monday night. I'll be back with updates later. Now here's Monica with Today Tonight.